third lesson, we're going to multiply and divide with algebraic fractions. So for question A, we've got x over 2 multiplied by x over 3. So we begin by multiplying the numerators. We have x squared, which is x times x, over 2 times 3, which is 6. For question B, we cannot divide with fractions, but we can multiply by its reciprocal. And to do that, we simply flip the fraction upside down, and that will give you B reciprocal. So it is 5 over 2x. And we can cross simplify here by dividing both by x, which is the numerator in one fraction and the denominator in another. So we have 1 over 4 multiplied by 5 over 2, which is 5 over 8. For question C, now before we work out this multiplication, we can factorise with 3x plus 6. So we have 3 lots of x plus 2 over 5 multiplied by 3 over x plus 2. Unlike we did with question B, where we cross simplified, we can do this again here, and this time we're going to divide both by the common factor of x plus 2. So these will cancel, and these will cancel. So we're left with 3 fifths multiplied by 3 over 1, which gives us 9 fifths. For question D, we can't cross simplify here because there are no common factors. So we have x plus 1 multiplied by x plus 2 over 2 lots of x minus 1. If we wanted to, we could expand these brackets out, but we don't need to. And for question E, we're going to firstly factorise the numerator. So we have 2 lots of x minus 1 over 3 multiplied by the reciprocal of this fraction, 4 over 2x minus 1. So we have... 2x minus, 2 lots of x minus 1 times 4, which is 8 lots of x minus 1, over 3 lots of 2x minus 1, which is 6x minus 3. And finally, for question f, we can cross-simplify with this 2 and this 6. We divide both by a common factor of 2. So we have... 3 lots of x plus 1 over 3 multiplied by 1 over x minus 1. And 3 will cancel. So we have x plus 1 over x minus 1. Thank you for watching. I hope you found that useful. And check out the link in the description for the full lesson and worksheet.